Wow, what a week it's been. I'm here at Soul Shine Villas in Abood, Bali after a week of transformation here for myself, Jillian, and Adam, but primarily our guests. Wow, uh, what an incredible week. I can't even begin to describe how fantastic it's been here at Soul Shine. Um, I landed in Bali and instantly fell in love. And then we moved to Soul Shine and I fell in love all over again. Um, I'll show you a little bit of the scenery here. Uh, this is the beautiful infinity pool that I skinny dipped and swam in every single day. Absolutely loved it and got into a nice little ritual of, of swimming every day, which I, I wish I had access to in my everyday life in my backyard, you know, a pool in my backyard. But um, being able to overlook the infinity pool onto the rice patties and, um, and then this is the dining area where we ate every single meal together. We filled that table. It was the perfect number of chairs. And then this is the little lily pad garden that leads into the kitchen where we did raw food, nutrition, and uh, culinary skills every single day. So everybody got to learn how to make the amazing dishes that we created. Um, we, we, Jillian had us creating four to five course lunches that were phenomenal, it tasted so great. And then in the evenings we'd go out and get some raw food out in town because there's phenomenal restaurants in town as well. There's about probably five raw, strictly raw uh, restaurants, so that was really fun to explore those and get to taste, but really Jillian's food is, is really far, far surpassing what we're tasting here in Bali, so that is, uh, uh, you know, cheers for Jillian, she's rocking it in the raw food culinary wizardry skills. And uh, it's starting to rain a little bit, but I wanted to show you a little bit more of just the vibrancy of the color here and the gorgeous landscaping I mean this is just absolute paradise I really really adore these trees and these vines and how they just rape out of the lobby and this is the main guest house and the studio is on the top floor um, and that's where we did yoga every single day and there was no better view than that rice paddy oh, expansive 360 degree view this is the main sitting area. And everyone's on their way out. Everyone's checking out after a week of amazing Pilates yoga, strengthening, flexibility, uh, alignment, awareness of body, uh, nutrition through raw food and culinary skills and just alkalinity versus acid and pH levels in the body and just we, we chatted everything nutrient density I mean you name it we covered it traveling tips when you're eating raw and and why we eat raw why what what does it give us vitality energy clarity connection to the planet and I am I just feel so blessed to have uh, had the guests that we had they were all amazing spirits positive and insightful and I learn so much from teaching you know I mean as a teacher I am supposed to be the teacher but I learn so much from my students and that's why I continue to teach and continue to do this work if I if I didn't teach um, and I only worked on myself I would never be able to see it in other bodies I would never feel the fulfillment of what it can do for somebody else and that's just the ultimate is that fulfillment at the end of class when they're in shavasana or they're fighting through their hundreds and you know Pilates mat and and then seeing that ha moment in their eyes and ah oh, that's what I'm supposed to feel ah oh, I'm feeling it now I'm building the strength I'm breathing three dimensionally you know all these things and and more importantly I'm just really excited that we were able to come together as a family on this retreat everybody was just from the get go just dropped in with everybody else was very conscious and aware of what everybody was going through and we chatted about that throughout the week. Um, it, I felt it was very important, Jillian and Adam and I, that we chat about with each other our experiences and what we're all going through and that they can relate to us as teachers as well um, in the way that we're all students. Every single one of us is a student and we learned just as much being here as they learned. We didn't go through the process. We weren't led through the process. We led the process. but. 
we learn so much by being the leaders and how to perfect our skills next time we do our next retreat. So it's been a phenomenal week, and I'm really sad to leave Solshine because it's just absolutely spectacular. And I'm sad to leave the group, but tonight we are going to go out dancing all night at the Bali Spirit Festival, which, wow, it's going to be, like, so fun. Ah. Oh. Bali Spirit is the festival celebrating yoga, music, and dance. So there's a great conscious hip-hop rapper tonight that will be going to shake our booties too for a couple hours. And I've missed dance so much this week, so I've been doing my own soft practice up on the studio uh, floor, doing some ballet, bar work, and things like that. But I really miss my training back home, so I'm excited to go shake it off tonight and uh, eat some good food with everybody and soak in the, the love that is Bali. Bali is a very, very special place, and it draws very special people, all interested in one love, in connection to each other and connection to the planet. And what better place to have a Raya Yoga Jedi retreat? What better place? <laughs> so anyway, I'll be sending out some testimonials from some of our guests, and um, I hope you guys will take a look and just see what they've gone through this week and be inspired by the potential that we all have within us. So cheers for now.